Hello and welcome to this week's channeled message. <sighs> Breathe it in. I'm your host, Christine Alexandria, the Dream Activator, the founder of Angel Chatter Academy and angelchatter.com. This week's message is brought to you by the Angel Chatter Oracle Deck. This was my very first product that I channeled in two weeks, the entire deck and guidebook. This week's message is brought to you by Camuel, the angel of self-love. And I believe this message, this card, made an appearance last month, but this is how important this concept of self-love is. Last week, we talked about manifestation, experiencing the life you desire. It will be difficult not impossible, difficult to experience, create, manifest the life you desire and deserve if you aren't loving on yourself, if you are having feelings of being an imposter, feeling unworthy because you don't have the proper education, no one in your family, say, has ever achieved this kind of accomplishment, no one has ever done this, it doesn't matter. I know some amazing people that didn't grow up in poverty. Well, we'll just say they grew up in undesirable circumstances and now making over $100,000 per month. It takes diligence. It takes acknowledging your imperfections because remember, you're a human. You have a beautiful imperfections meaning you can always do better. You can always discover something about yourself to love more. It's an amazing thing. It's an amazing journey. This thing called self-love, because the more you love yourself, the more you permit to put your desires in the forefront. Say you want a new job say you want romance, you want better health, you want more prosperity, different location, where do you desire to live? And it's acknowledging, the first step would be to say, yep, I do want that. I would love that because that, that manifestation of whatever it is, would help support my soul would help me fulfill my life's mission. It's a different way to look at it. It's not being greedy. It's recognizing what you need in order to be more at ease, to be happier, to be luxurious. And luxurious doesn't mean you just have all this money and you hoard it. Luxurious can mean when you go out with friends, you can say, hey, it's on me tonight because you feel like giving. You can start your own charitable organization. You can help students achieve. My husband shared a story with me and I'm not gonna remember everything, but this woman's husband had died and unbeknownst to her, he had over $1 billion worth of stock. She was a doctor, very successful, did not have a need for this money. So she has donated it. And college students at this particular school are now going to be getting tuition free. And those that are currently in will be uh, refunded for what they have already paid in. That can be a form of luxury. So luxury is not just sitting around eating bonbons, watching soap operas. But unless that's what you want to do, is that going to fuel your soul? So self-love is being aware of what you need and then giving yourself permission to do just that. Whether it's showing up here on camera, I'll be starting a podcast soon, you know, helping more people is something that really fuels my soul. Activating your dreams helps fuel my soul, helping you achieve, expire, empowering you. <clears throat> For me, that is a form of self-love, but I can't do all this giving and helping and inspiring unless I take care of myself behind the scenes. 
giving myself permission to go sow, giving myself permission to garden, giving myself permission, and this is the most difficult one for me, to do nothing, lay in the hammock, literally, and do nothing. What does your soul need? How can you, so go ahead, pop some ideas below so we can support and cheer you on. What are some things you could do for you that say, I love me? And if you're really stumped, I got something for you. Go back over to angelchatteracademy.com and look up the itty bitty course of self-love. And for a very, very limited time, you can save $5 off 23. So super low price already at $23. $5 off the itty bitty course of self-love. That's how much I desire you to honor you more. So until next week, place your hands over your heart. <sighs> Breathe that in. Knowing Camuel's got their wings over yours and just say, I love you. Go ahead, right now, say it. Say it out loud. I love you. Mm. You're amazing. And until next time, have a good one. Bye for now.